This question given is a semicircle with radius 6 cm. Inside it we are drawing another semicircle with diameter as 6 cm. Now we are drawing a third circle which is touching the blue circle and green circle and the diameter of the bigger circle. We have to find what is the radius of this full circle. Let's check the solution. Let's assume the center of this green semicircle is Q and this purple circle it's tangential to this point. Let's assume it as S. Let's join Q and P. So we are dealing with triangle QPS that's this yellow triangle and this radius is perpendicular to tangent. So this angle is 90 degrees. This length is this is 3 centimeter radius of semicircle and this is radius of purple circle. So this full QP is 3 plus R. QO that's 3 centimeter. OS let's assume this value as X. Now applying Pythagoras theorem. So we'll get 3 plus X square plus R square is equals to 3 plus R whole square. So opening up the bracket. Now to simplifying it will uh, cancel out r square on both the sides also will cancel out 9 on both the sides so simplifying it will get x square plus 6x is equals to 6r let's multiply it with 2 on both the sides we'll see why we had multiplied with 2 so we'll get 2x square plus 12x is equals to 12r so we have got one equation in two variables so we need to form one more triangle to form one more equation and get the value of x and r. So for same we will join OP and extend it further. Now we know that when two circles are touching internally or externally the point of the contact and their centers are in straight line. Now this particular length will be nothing but capital R and the length of this full red line. So this is the radius of blue circle which is 6 cm. So this is full length is 6 and out of which this is R. So OP, OP is nothing but 6 minus R. So in we have got this right angle triangle that's triangle OPR. So in this yellow triangle this angle is 90 degrees. So we'll apply Pythagoras theorem. So x square plus r square is 6 minus r square. So opening up the bracket. Now both the sides your r will r square will get cancelled down. So on simplifying it we will get x square minus 36 is equals to minus 12 r. Now these two yellow equations if we will add so right side this is 12 r this is negative 12 r. So both will cancel down each other and on the left side we have got 2x square plus x square. So that will give me 3x square plus 12x and minus 36 equals to 0. So this is a quadratic equation. We'll solve it by splitting the middle term. So 3 times 36 that is 108. So 12x we have to split. So that product is 108. So 12 will split as 18 and minus 6. So factorizing it. Now here x is coming as negative 6 which is not possible. And thus the value of x is nothing but 2. So putting this value of x as 2 will get the value of r as 8 by 3. So any of the yellow equation we can put the value of x as 2 to get r as 8 by 3. And this is our answer. I hope you enjoyed the solution. I'll see you next video. Till then, tata, bye bye.